welcome to my week six pregnancy vlog. It is up a day late. I apologize, but yesterday was Labor Day and I took the day off and spent it with my side of the family. You may hear cartoons going into the living room. I'm sitting in my bedroom right now, so I'm trying to keep Bryson occupied. He may end up coming in here, but that's fine. Hopefully, I can get done with this video. Um, today, I'm very tired, so I'm it's taken a lot out of me. <laughs> um, but today has been a pretty off day for me. Um, I did have nausea this morning and did get sick, but tired. The tiredness and fatigue has hit me this afternoon, so I apologize if I'm not really too upbeat. Um, but on a wonderful note, today is Tuesday, September 8th, and I am seven weeks and three days. Um, so I'm going to recap for my week six pregnancy symptoms. Um, my morning sickness had kicked in on six weeks and two days, and I think that might have been on Monday. So six weeks, one, yeah, on a Monday, um, last Monday, it morning sickness, excuse me. Um, <coughs> My voice tried to go in out. Um, at six weeks and two days, which was last Monday, I woke up feeling nauseated. And it just kind of like hit me, bam, as soon as I opened my eyes. So I had to get up and I got me some water and ate me some uh, saltine crackers. That seemed to help just a little bit, but I still stayed nauseated. Um, I had laid down, back, laid back down. And Bryson had laid back down with me after we dropped the boys off. We took a really good nap. And so far, that has been our routine. So, he's been so sweet. And, um, thankfully, he's been wanting to lay down with me and take a nap. So, usually, we'll eat breakfast. If we don't eat breakfast before we take the boys to school, we'll eat it when we come back home and watch a few cartoons. And then we lay down for a nap on the couch. So, I don't interfere with my husband's sleep in the bedroom. And so far, that has been working out so good. Um, we lay down and take a nap before about 9 o'clock. And we don't wake up till about 11.45. And it has been so nice. Um, I woke up that next morning at 6 weeks and 3 days. And I went to open the refrigerator to get the boys snacks ready for school. And as soon as I opened the refrigerator, I gagged and had to run to the bathroom. Um... I don't know if it was just the refrigerator or the coldness or what, but I've noticed when we go to Walmart or go grocery shopping, I cannot stand the cold section where produce is at, meat, anything that has like a freezer section or really cold, I keep gagging and I have to like cover my mouth. I could not stand it the last time I was at Walmart. It was horrible. So, it's got to do something with the coldness or something. I don't know. But, it, it just, it does not sit with me very well. Um, I've only gotten sick twice, but the rest of the, the days I've been nauseated and I do gag at smells. Um, if I bend over, which is kind of weird, I could just, like in the mornings, if I have to bend over to pick up something, you better bet I'm going to gag when I bend over. I don't know what it is. Um... But like I said, I only got sick twice. I got sick on the Tuesday, last Tuesday, and then I got sick this morning. And I'm seven weeks and three days today. So, um, that's not too bad. I can really tolerate it. Um, I had went to Walmart and got me some C-bands. I had used these, um, when I was pregnant with Bryson. And I, I think I got a blue pair, but I could not find them. So, I just went and bought me some more. And these are black. And these has helped me so much. I have to keep these on just about at all times. Um, I take them off for bath and then when I lay down at night. But then when I wake up, um, I wake up several times to use the restroom at night. But if I wake up in the morning time, like in the early morning hours, I do put them on. That way it kind of helps take the edge off when I wake up for the morning and the morning sickness is kind of minimum um so this has really helped me um another symptom i had for week six was i'm staying tired and weak 
today is a pretty bad day for me. I'm just really worn out and it really didn't hit me until the afternoon. So when we got the boys from school, it just kind of like bam hit me and I felt so weak and lightheaded and just, you know, blah. Um, and not feeling really, really good. I could probably lay down and go to sleep right now. Um, also, new for week six was, um, and I, I'm still doing that also, is I'm getting hot flashes, but then I get cold. Um, right now, I'm pretty hot and sweaty and like, ugh. Um, so, I don't know if that has to do with the hormones of pregnancy or if it's the progesterone also because I did have just a tad bit of the hot flashes when I started the progesterone but really didn't mention it in any of my vlogs but that I can remember um but so I don't know if it's that I don't know um what else I've had a couple of headaches um not too bad but I, I did have to take a, a Tylenol the other night, um, or the other day. I took a Tylenol and laid back down to take a nap, and when I woke up, it was over. Um, so, I am getting a couple of headaches, and um, I'm still getting cramps off and on. There was two days in a row. Um, it was right before I turned seven weeks, and I hurt so bad. Um, it was in, in my front front area around my uterus and my lower back and I, I cramped pretty bad but I didn't have any spotting so I didn't worry too bad about it I just figured it was probably just the baby growing um, since it was towards the end of the week so so far today I have not had any really bad cramping um, I do get mild cramping off and on but it hasn't been like bad like it was those couple of days um, so I go to the doctor Thursday and um, we get to have an ultrasound and I'm excited to see the baby and I've just been praying so hard that the baby looks okay and is on, on target of, of its growth and we see a heartbeat. So what I'm going to try to do is, is I'll try, if I can't, I apologize, but I'm going to try and do a separate update with the ultrasound. If I don't, don't hold it against me. Um, I'll just add it into my next week for my seventh week um, pregnancy vlog um, because right now with the tiredness and fatigue really kicking my butt um, y'all may have to just excuse if I do miss a vlog uh, but hopefully I could stay on track uh uh baby no 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 thank you so um, this is my end of my vlog Bryson keeps moving around me um this has kind of been a scattered video i apologize but it's just it's one of those days um i'm just so exhausted um we're probably gonna go to bed early tonight um you got your thomas come here you want to tell everybody bye look uh oh don't fall look look can you say bye everybody say see you next week say bye are you not going to say bye? There you go. Wave look. There you go. Thank you. See you. Bye. Say so see y'all next week. <laughs> bye, everybody.